Hello, Jess Too Good here. Today we're taking a look at the Lego Hidden Side Newbury Juice Bar Set, which has two minifigures, 127 pieces, and you can get this from Lego Shop at Home with orders over $50 at the beginning of September, though this promotion is ending very soon. Here is Rocky, and this character, even though he's working at a juice bar, he has like a coffee outfit. I mean, the color scheme just doesn't even fit with this, and I get it. They didn't want to put any exclusive prints or anything in a cheap giveaway promo like this, but it would have been cool to get something because, you know, there's other giveaway promos that do have exclusive prints. He does have an alternate facial expression where he looks pretty shocked. As for his haunted version, they do use this kind of uncommon hairpiece, which is in a lot of hidden side sets, but nothing too cheap. So I do appreciate that. I mean, I guess the cheapest is the graveyard set. And you got that face print at the front that does appear in a lot of sets as well. And at the back, there's some printing. So that's nice. And the set also includes Parker, and she is using the outfit that she has in some of the more expensive sets. That's really cool to get in a giveaway promo like this. Same one by two print. And she has an alternate facial expression at the back, which you can see she's smiling. So the build of the set is simple and very compact. And I think I like it better now that I have it all built than I did with the official pictures. Yeah, that happens a lot. Sorry, guys. <laughs> but the design of this actually has some exclusive stickers. So you got two in the back there. Also some kind of hard to find pieces in cheap sets, at least like these corner pieces in that sand green. Uh, the corner pieces right here in that black are nice to get. And for the stickers, there's one for the slush ice at the front and these two machines at the front. I do wish they did a better job with, I guess, these slushies or these ice pops or whatever you want to call them. I don't think this cone piece inverted on one of these uh, one by one stamp pieces, as they call it, really work. There's not much else they could have done if they didn't do prints. So I think an exclusive print or something would have been cool. Maybe on the bottle here or something. I don't know. I just don't think these are perfect for like little slush ices or whatever you want to call them. Now there is the play feature of this, of course, which is if you open up this, it reveals the hidden side. And that hidden side is like a lot of the hidden side sets, a spooky face. And that actually uses that new one by one print for those hidden side sets. And also there's some stickered pieces in the back here. Also getting this one by two modified with the two fangs, though that hasn't come in a set since I think Ninjago possessed in 2015. So that's pretty cool to get here. I do wish there was a little bit more space inside the slush ice stand. There's only about eight studs for him to stand. It's not too big of a deal though. And they don't have too much other detailing besides what you see at the front here with these machines here. Though I do like how they have these colors of the slush ice uh, drink or whatever you want to call it, the mix. Though it is weird that they have blue and orange, but there's no blue and orange here. Instead, we get green, yellow, and red. Other than that, though, there's not too much else going on here. Very cool little play feature that goes in line with the other hidden side sets. I'm not sure how this set in particular interacts with the app, but uh, I'm sure there's one way or another that there's a secret thing or something to unlock in there. But that's it for the build of the set. Let's take a look at the packaging and then the final verdict. The box for this is like that $10 box size that comes with a few sets. This could actually be a set that is just sold separately, not a giveaway promo, but it is nice that they gave this as a giveaway promo. As for the instructions, while there's not an ad for the other sets, they do have an ad for the app and some new artwork of this character turning into the ghost. So that's actually kind of cool. You know, they did put a little bit of effort into the packaging and everything of this to make it in line with the other sets. And I appreciate that for a giveaway promo. So overall, this is just one of those sets I was hard on at the start that I ended up really liking. I think the compact design that could fit into a Lego City is actually much cleverer than what I first thought of it as, which I thought it was just kind of a ripoff of that Been There Donut, that set, which it wasn't really that interesting in the first place. And there are some nice pieces that are very hard to find that are in this set, so that's pretty cool. Now, I can't really rate it because it is a free giveaway promo, but I do recommend this one in terms of not only that it has such a low threshold because it's only $50, sometimes promos are $75 or $100, and this one is a lot cheaper, but also it's just a good way to get introduced into the LEGO Hidden Side theme where it has a lot of the common tropes with those other sets and also has some really nice pieces. So that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.